gunman attacked a five-star hotel in Libya's capital Tuesday, detonating a car bomb outside before making their way to an upper floor of the Corinthia Hotel in Tripoli. Two heavily armed gunmen were able to kill at least eight people, including four foreigners, before blowing themselves up. Reuters North Africa bureau chief Patrick Markey in Algiers. Well, Corinthia Hotel is one of the main, if not the main, five-star hotel in, in, in Tripoli. It's uh, right on the waterfront of the city. It's also home to... Um, you know, foreign dignitaries and uh, foreign delegations and even government officials stay there. So it's certainly um, a high-profile target in terms of the government officials and foreign officials who have been staying there in Tripoli descended into violence last summer when two rival factions began battling for control of the country. The internationally recognized government based in eastern Libya still claims legitimacy while a rival administration took over the capital. With the current political situation, it's not yet clear who perpetrated Tuesday's deadly attack. The reports we're hearing is one from a, a small little known group that claims to be uh, tied or associated with the Islamic State militants fighting in Iraq and Syria. But the government in Tripoli is saying that this was actually an assassination attempt against its prime minister who was in the hotel at the time. Most foreign governments closed their embassies and pulled staff from Tripoli after fighting between the factions erupted last summer.